that point. He has said multiple times Casey. that he likes toxic, he likes crazy girls. Oh, and no, I feel what? like he's getting into what he's used to. Hold on, boo. Hold on. I'm finna put you on speaker. Hold on. All right, say something. What she cannot hear. Is he on speaker? Hello. Hello. Yeah, we can't hear. Yo, how was cheating on me the whole time to give me the fuck you ain't right now? You let another nigga come and please your ass. Like, you can't do shit like that. Like, you, what are you, like, you got everything you got. Shit, no, we're not like that, bitch. I'm not a stupid ass nigga. I'm not a stupid ass nigga that falls no crazy ass. But I can't hear him. Can't hear him. This is phone. Speak up to now, it's your phone. If I actually beat you, you would have got all live and shoot the bruises that I actually beat you, your nose, wherever the fuck I put to get you at. You would have showed that. You didn't show no fucking proof that I that okay? put my hands on you. You wouldn't have that motherfucking camera rolling. Four cameras. You would, you got four fucking phones. You wouldn't have all four cameras rolling if I punch in your face. Come on. Don't I'm not that. used like, to being okay. beat. I don't think to myself, oh, oh, let me record this. I'm not like you. Lying like a butterfucking I don't do dog. That. The fuck trying to play this and you too goddamn old for that you ain't about to hit 40 you acting like a fucking child be a fucking woman be a fucking woman if you want to be my woman motherfucking your attention your the attention seeking that you reaching but you will never reach nothing close to me oh jesus you fucking with real bitches like barbie that fucked your ex nigga that's why i know you miserable you fuck with miserable people miserable people love company but can no, I, can y'all work on y'all relationship? Can y'all fix this? Because she still cares. You're a grown woman body, gang. You get on internet and neck like a little girl. Do everything that you do. You say, this is my soap. This is my, I bought this, I bought that, I bought that. You know the definition between me and you and women? You don't know how to be a woman. Because a woman won't bash their man on the internet. A woman won't come to the internet and say, my man still drugs. Oh, I don't like my man doing this and doing that. Airing out his fucking business. A woman won't do that shit. A woman will beard that man up. Right or wrong. True. If a nigga step for that woman, you will be right there stepping behind your fucking man. No, you in the motherfucking cloud screaming help, calling 911. What's your emergency? Want to act a fucking Karen. But when somebody call your ass white, it's a problem. But you so black, right? When somebody call your little white ass Karen or white, it's a problem. But you out here calling police officers. You out here making statements. Nine paragraph, nine pages in a statement. Hey, nine, did you, yeah, he or did you not have multiple recordings of me before I ever dialed 911? Girl, hold up. First of all, you, 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 she's been talking the whole time. I know where I want to be about. No, she's listening. Don't mute her. She's listening. Yeah. She's actually been polite and she's listening. I'm talking. I asked I'm her like, a question. Because this bitch put a restraining order on me. Put a whole warrant for my arrest. Went down to court and not in Las Vegas. Picked up my motherfucking charges. Now, first of all, yeah, First of all, you talking about secret recording? Them secret recording is because that you get on the internet and play victim like I did be on you, Yetta. Like I just touched you. So I had them recording to show the proof that I don't do you shit. That you come in a room every day to question fuck and mess with me every fucking morning. Question. Mute this bitch. I don't know why the fuck Yetta still yes. on mute. Mute this bitch. Please. Wait, no, no, no. <laughs> hey, hold on. Now, you got to be fair. Hold on, K9. I know you upset. Hold on. Wait, 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 Roy. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 buddy. Hold on. I know you upset, but hold on. You you just being too disrespectful, and she is trying to stay calm. That's Miss Empress. I'm sorry, Miss Empress. You know. I know, but just 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 try to stay calm. You got to call her every bitch in the world. I got a question for you. Yetta just got a simple question for you. She just want to ask your question. How can you tell people, you can say that I went on live telling everybody that you beat on me. That's not true. You told everybody when you played that first recording on live. Nobody ever knew me and you ever got into anything physical until you played the recording that you secretly took. 
of me crying Does about how I was bleeding from the head. Lie? You just gonna sit here, to mute her real quick, mute her again. Girl, this started when we were no 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 it was at the motherfucking house. Stop the fucking cap, yeah. Man, you just capping like a motherfucker. Like you told everybody before before we even got a house together, that you told people I fell just and hit you. And he goes there in the background, yep, you do that shit, yep. Now when y'all actually broke up Lear actually I admitted that I don't touch you, I don't say shit to your stupid ass, you fuck with me. You next by food. What well, what actually what happened was the fuck up, put that food in the refrigerator. If you're a real woman, a woman not gonna argue about no motherfucking food. Put that shit in the refrigerator. Actually, what happened was, you said, she, I quit Yetta. my job for her. Yetta, why do you want to listen to this? I have a question, Yetta. Selling drugs? Yetta, why do you want to listen to this? Why do you want to listen to him talk to you this way? Why do you want to? Why do you want to? Talk about everything. You're right. Everything, it was a motherfucking nag with Yetta. Everything got to be about Yetta. What about fucking King Nine? Bitch, you about to hit 40. What about my motherfucking feeling? I got a heart, too. I'm a human. I got a fucking feeling. What wrong with this lady, man? They, Everything about fucking Yetta. Yetta, you about to hit 40. I'm 22 years old. What the fuck? What about my motherfucking life, nigga? Stop playing with my top. You trying to lock my little black ass up and throw away the key. You trying to throw that bitch away. I ain't even hit 25 yet. You trying to put me behind motherfucking ceilings and walls. You ain't do none of this shit to notch or TKO. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Nigga took 17 racks from your ass. You ain't knock his ass up, huh? Nigga hit your ass with a smoothie. You ain't lock his ass up, huh? Nigga made you do coke with wavy. He ain't lock his ass up, huh? A nigga be nothing trying to get you pregnant by a motherfucking puppet. He ain't lock his ass up, huh? But you want to lock a little K9 up. Fuck around with you over, uh, over a Discord. Over a Discord, get up? So you you show your soul and your pussy to Barbie in a Discord? You worry about what the fuck people say about a Discord? And guess what? I don't give a fuck what nobody say about me. I don't. The motherfucker don't give no rent pay. No, the fucker don't give me no money. You care about everybody got to say something about you. Even when they post your pussy pictures in the motherfucking Discord. They post your pussy, your pussy in live. I want to stop this, but Yetta is here for it. Let, 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 do y'all understand Yetta wants to hear yeah, this? If you put your pussy on a platform. I don't. I'm waiting for the time to run out. Somebody go screenshot that shit? The time is going to run out. Be a fucking woman. Own up to your own shit. Stop throwing other people in your fucking business. The fuck, and I know you got on the internet and say, Can I do this? He bring that shit to the internet, he punch fingers. I know you say that. And guess what? We both did that shit. Guess what? You can't own up to your own fucking wrong. We both did that shit. We both did some weird crazy. So Don't say case K9. Say both of them. I you're not a real woman to own up to your own fucking miserable life. You miserable. You got past trauma. You got past, love, love to love yourself. When you love yourself yet and believe in God. I bet your life be much I've never been suicidal. I've never cut myself. I've never done anything okay. of the stuff that you do. All right, hold on. Let me let y'all understand. So who's um, Sammy? Yetta, do you want us to put him on quiet so you don't hear him? Or do you, or do you want him to just keep talking to the time right now? Get, so y'all understand. Only got so much time. I, yeah. So y'all understand. Got, Roy, stop got, this. Got, Je Yetta is stop. listening because she do wants to rebuttal. She's listening to him. She oh. wants to hear it. Yetta, one more time. Miss Empress, I need you to listen. I need everybody in live right now to hear this out. And y'all y'all see this shit. Y'all mute Yetta real quick. Right. Name one time you don't see Yetta saying nothing about you now. Name one time you never see Yetta in my motherfucking window watching. Name one time you never seen Yetta and Barbara just sit on the line and say K9 this and K9 that. I'll teach you this and teach you that. Name one time you never saw Yetta stalk me. She stalked me. Oh, she was just come to my live and sit there. And add shit on and start shit. And when somebody get on her ass, it's a problem. Name one time. And I know the time is saying, oh, 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 I know the time is going down. You watch me. Mm -hmm. You lurking. You stalking me. I don't say shit about nobody on my platform unless a bitch never say something to me. I got pure content. I don't need nobody else to get my motherfucking content popping. I can sit with 3,000 views and be on five boxes. The fuck wrong with you? Oh, you can't get. Oh, you can't mute her. That's the only. Mm -hmm. That's the only point I had to prove. You stalk me. You watch me. You stalk with me. I don't fix shit. So yeah, now what you gonna do? Cause it's a lot of energy, and it's a lot of going back and forth. Y'all obviously got like ill will feelings towards one another, 
And I know it's because you just mad, you locked up right now, you find us some crazy news from the lawyers. No, yet I yet gotta let go. Yet I gotta let go. Despite who did what. Yet I gotta let this go. Okay, oh Jesus, I don't give a fuck about this shit. Shit, shit, this ain't my first word of your Shit, I ain't tweaking about none of that shit. Oh, it seems like you started to blow up after. This is my first year, you know, man. I know how to. I know the program. Oh Jesus! When I'm around the police, it's yes sir, no man. When I leave, this bitch, oh. fuck the face. Oh Jesus! She's still emotionally connected, so yeah. this gonna be interesting. Yeah. You can't help. No, me. I want. But I don't know what or listen. What's going on? Yeah, that is an adult. Yetta knows exactly what's happening here. She can handle herself. She wants to hear him out. That's her therapy. That's how she's going to cope with this. She wants to hear him. Despite if he's telling the truth or not, yelling, cursing her out, she mm -hmm. wants to receive his words. He, he gets like this when he's emotional. And then tomorrow he'll be texting me, calling me queen. It's just... I can't wait for I get out of jail. I'm going to show see? all our messages. Yeah, I don't say shit to your weird ass. Stop the fucking count. You know what? You on live right now. Can you show all our messages? Start from the top. We're not supposed to show text messages. That's how you get I don't want to text your ass back. Oh, Jesus. When you say, let me take you out to dinner, I ain't know that shit. Now, that's and I was going to show up at the time you I told you to be ready, too. Let me clean your house for $200 and I'll get some dick. I know what that shit. Now, I want y'all to hear this oh, now. Yeah. Although he is being message. very aggressive, what did Yetta just do? She made an excuse message. for him. She said he gets like the... this when he's angry. Like so I want y'all to listen. Like you thought you, like you thought you gonna disrespect my woman? My new bitch? You think you gonna disrespect my new bitch talking about you was at my oh, husband? the new bitch girl? who be hanging out no, in your lap, not saying the goddamn thing, the same shit you complaining about I was doing? You do this one, please. Y'all doing one at a time. Because I hate a miserable-ass woman, bro. But if we had sex, Yetta, we had sex. Yeah, we did what we did. I hear you hit this, I fucked you from the back, I ate your pussy, you suck my dick, whatever. Whatever the fuck we did. You got on the internet like a little girl, because that's what little girls do. And post my motherfucking house pictures. That's some weird shit. Why you going around my house taking pictures, bro? That's weird. That's weird. Then you want to go throw shots at another woman. They don't even know you. I can't complain. You want to call her some bitches and hoes. This woman don't even fucking know you. You want to call her a tranny, all type of shit. This bitch don't even know you. I didn't so call her tranny. Her? Why you so like mad at the woman? And you want to call her so dumb. You want to call her dumb and shit, but you the she dumb. Do like you was a fool. You got on the internet and say that we had sex Friday, right? But we wasn't even together Friday. I told her we had sex. So you know what? You thought you had one up on a, a, a you thought you had one up on my girl, but my girl really looked at you like, bitch, you a fool. He already told me that y'all fucked. So what's the point of you telling everybody that we fucked? I don't give a fuck. Oh, you don't give a fuck now, but you got on the internet and say this shit, right? Yeah, because you just disrespected the fuck out of me okay, after I got mad that you allowed a nigga to expose my phone number. After you already exposed it yourself. You thought you thought you had uh, one up. Uh, no, you exposed yourself while posting my motherfucking house. Talk about King Don Kingdom. Here you go, fucking up the sequence of events. Two weeks ago, you exposed all three of my fucking phone my numbers. Point, man. I just proved my point. Yet, you love miserable, and you miserable as fuck. If you still hang with Barbie, you is a miserable woman. How you let your best friend fuck your nigga and you best friends with the bitch? He not my nigga. I just don't get it. I don't get it. He's she fucked your not nigga. my nigga. I just don't get it. And, and another thing is, the another thing is, how you sit around a bitch that talked about you like a dog and came in your nigga lie. You have and one in my life. Me and you got into it. She came in my life with her honey bunny. Oh, honey Lord. Bunny. Here we go with this shit. Way. Talk about, I want to suck K9 dick. So how you friends with a bitch that says she want to suck my dick? How do you feel, Yetta? A fucking miserable, dumb-ass, hurt-ass bitch. To be a miserable bitch like Barbie. Who, when y'all was beefing, you say she was kid. Ain't no bitch gonna kill my motherfucking man time. Ain't no bitch gonna play on my motherfucking man. I don't give a fuck, you my ex nigga, bitch. If a bitch come in my motherfucking man line and say, I want to suck your dick, K9, and don't motherfucking get that on. Bitch, and you gonna be friends with him? Bitch, you is miserable. And another thing is, when we had a big ass panel, you mean that messy panel we had? Me, you, Barbie, 
And Kyle was up there, and when the girl actually was at Barbara King, we have a threesome, and Barbara just laughed, and he just looked at her. You a miserable bitch. You supposed to say, bitch, what you laughing for? What the fuck you laughing for, bitch? You want to fuck my nigga for real? Thank you for using the Kira. Goodbye. Yeah, this a lot. They are going through a lot. No, I'm going to ask you a question. You know, how many men have talked to you like this? Is this comfortable for you? No, I'm used to it at this point, though, with him. He always does this. Like, he just loves to berate me like that. And I really think <laughs> he does enjoy having everybody hate me. That's why he made that discord. And he says that he made that discord for people to drag everybody, not just me. But it's definitely a I hate yet a discord. And that was a big problem in the relationship. When I was bleeding from the head in the bathroom, I do admit I wouldn't move out of his way because I wanted to have a conversation about the fact that he created an Instagram chat called the Naughty Room. And I wanted to see the chat. And we were downstairs when it started. And he wouldn't show me his phone. He wouldn't let me look through the chat, even though he was like, I'm not even saying nothing in there. And I'm like, are there nudes in there? Like, what the fuck is the naughty room? And he wouldn't show it to me. And I went upstairs, got naked, was about to get in the shower. And he came upstairs, too. And I closed the door to the bathroom and wanted to talk about it. And he told me some sounds personal. Sounds personal. That's what he always would say when I would tell him how I feel about something. Sounds personal. Like, he didn't give a mm -hmm. fuck. So... I'm like, no, we're going to fucking talk about this now. Any any girlfriend would be upset about you creating an Instagram chat called The Naughty Room, and I'm not in it. Like, I, agree. The fuck? Why I, I, I agree, so, yes. but you know what, Yetta? How many years are y'all apart? I totally agree with that. It's the age difference. Oh, the you back? I might as well just bounce. He's just going to want me to be muted the whole fucking 10 minutes. No, we didn't mute you. But Yetta, you you can talk. Yeah, but you don't have to listen to it either, my mama. You don't have to listen to this. I just really want that. That's why I said I might as well leave. Get past this. Get past it because whew, I don't think it's going to happen overnight. Gonna happen. Well, y'all tell me. I don't him. want you to. Yeah, I don't want to see him. you back with him. I do not want to see y'all dating again. So don't you get weak <laughs> despite the card. Because I can see in your eyes, ma. You, Yetta. Thank you so much, big girl. All right, he's going to call back. Yeah, the, no, ma'am. Y'all tell him I'm going to keep his car safe. I yeah. hope he gets out. Like, that was the whole reason why I told him about the warrant that I knew of. I don't know nothing about these other charges. I did not go to court and press charges on him. There was a statement that I wrote the day that I got arrested, and that must be where this is coming from. I don't understand why. There wasn't a warrant issued for that. I just paid $2,365 for the warrant. When I called the police, the day he came on here and said, I'm taking Yetta to court. She just got served. Yetta got served. I was like, no, I didn't. I told people on live, I didn't get served. What are you talking about? He's lying. He's lying. I didn't get served with shit because I didn't know you could get served on the email. I went and checked my email and opened up the document that was attached. Hmm. It was a court date for April 13th. I was like, whoa. Okay. What the fuck? So he's, he's trying to he's trying to protect me to court to prove that I falsified my temporary protection order. Everything I wrote on that actually fucking happened. Now, I don't have recordings to prove it. So I'm like, damn, I called an attorney and they said I told him and he already texted me. He already violated the fucking protection order. I didn't text him back. They were like, well, you should report it for sure because it's going to look good for you in, in court. If he does take you to court, you're going to have something. So I'm like, OK, so I called them about that. I didn't know that they actually issued the warrant until I got it in the mail. When I got it in the mail, I went it over. I brought it to him, told him what happened. I didn't know at the time that they were, he wasn't going to go to court. I didn't know he wasn't going to go to court. I didn't know we were going to get back together. He was going to move back into the house secretly. I didn't know that he wasn't going to go. And if he never would have went on live and said, I just served Yetta. Da, 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 I never would have even knew that that was me getting served in that email because I didn't think that was possible. Mm -hmm. So anyway, I told him about the warrant. I told him I would take care of it. I felt bad about it. He never took me to court. So I was like, damn, I shouldn't have called them. But I didn't know. I couldn't see the future that he wasn't going to actually go. And I know <laughs> that for a fact. Now, I didn't lie about a goddamn thing on that TPO report. None of it was false. None of it was false. I'm not about to do no, no jail time for false. That's not, that's not no little minimum offense. Lying to get somebody put out. That's the bad. I didn't lie. 
So yeah, I'm gonna do what I need to do to protect myself. I'm calling and tell them you you didn't violate your TPO already. The, the the hour after they didn't kick you out the house, here you go texting me. You know you're not supposed to have no contact. So yes, I snitched on him for that. He got a warrant for it. I told him about it. I paid it, and I told him it was gonna take days to go away. Don't do nothing crazy. Stop driving crazy. Don't do that. You know, like what the fuck? And then he gets arrested today, and now there's a surprise extra warrants. I didn't know shit about that. You think I'm going to spend $2,365 for nothing? This is exactly what I didn't want to happen. I did not want him to go to jail. I didn't want his success to stop. And I told him that. I'm like, you're doing really well. You're doing everything I wanted you to do when we were still together. And trying to make it seem like I never wanted him to shine and he's shitting on me now. I'm clapping for you. I wanted you to move out. I wanted you to get your own place. I wanted you to have your shit together. I wanted you not to depend on me. Okay, so why did you go meet up with him on Friday? Because even before that meetup, y'all already been having problems. So why was it okay for you to go to his house on Friday and for y'all to get entangled again? Uh, I don't know, because I always miss him. When he's not when he's not around, I be missing him. Aww. It's just weird. It's, we have some soul ties or whatever, toxic fucking shit heart trauma shit i don't fucking know i never been in no like i guess tko can compare to this but he never i is as, as bad as tko was, i feel mm -hmm. like this is worse oh, yeah she love him yetta don't know how to shake it yetta don't know how to call it quits because she feels as though she invests so much but it's cool mm -hmm. um I, I wish him all the best. That's what I've been telling him. Like, I don't want you to be out here failing. I'm rooting for you. Like the whole Zayful thing, the the promotion that we got. He's he's all talking about some y'all. Look, I'm leveling up. Umbigo chose me for this. I recommended him. My account manager reached out to me and asked me for hosts that would be good for it. I told her, K9. I, I sent him the link and told him to fill this out. You were which program to was it? Which program deal. was that? Huh? Which program was that? The Zayful promotion that just happened the other day. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And I saw him with the clothes. Yeah. Yes. So he for him to, to try to paint this narrative that I'm always trying to shit on him and I don't want to see him win, that's bullshit. I, I, I'm constantly trying to help him. So, I mean, like, it, it goes, it goes. Can you go to the court un tomorrow to undo whatever was done? Or can you go? I didn't press it. The, the, they, in the state of Nevada, they do shit different here, probably because of all the hoes and pimps that be in, in Vegas. So it doesn't matter if the hoe says, I don't want to press charges. If the cops know that there has been abuse, they're going to fucking do it themselves. The city will press the charges. It doesn't have anything that the county will press the charges. Mm -hmm. So I wrote a statement that day that I went to jail. So that's probably where it came from. I never went to court. I never went to court to file a report or file charges against him ever. Yeah, if the state got it, it's out of her hands. I get it. Oh, no. I don't know. Maybe something. Mm. Yeah, the, <sighs> they just have to don't sit. don't get back in no relationship with um this separate. Y'all are no good for each other. No I, good. And it's toxic, and it's just gonna keep happening, happening over and over again. And it's just going to get worse. It's just going to get worse. I just hope that he realizes one day that everything that I got upset with him about, any girl would get upset about. Like, you can't be in a relationship and treat your girl like shit. You can't yep. be in a relationship and say, well, that sounds personal when she coming to you about how she feels about a situation. Like, I don't think that any of the things that I, I had problems with him with were unreasonable i'm not i'm not some type of weird psycho bitch that always wants to control people it's not like that i just want respect oh, man. hold on miss yetta rugain stop saying that before we kick you out i do what not rugain saying you're doing too much what oh, you're doing too much you're doing too much i can't have anybody i ever wanted no conversation no she's not dang k9 y'all y'all lost why you keep saying that's, that? that's not even the no, not issue here lost. Right, they didn't even, I don't even know, understand okay. what that means. You don't say it about 50 times. I'm doing too much. And people that but see, Yada, you know what a big difference is? So it'd be different if you was in your 40s and he uh -huh. was in his 30s because it would have given you both time to grow up. But 
he is not on your level mentally. Come on, boss. You know? So, and then you have your own issues, too. And that just ain't no good mix. What boss said? I understand what you're saying. Um, yeah, and, and women mature faster than men, too. So, uh, wow. he's probably even younger mentally than his age shows. But at the same time, I feel like even eight-year-olds can understand reason. Even eight-year-olds can understand reason. Right from wrong. No, yeah. You know, you know, you know I care for you. You know I care for you as my brother's ex-girlfriend. But the one thing that we have to do is keep it 100% honest about that night. When I was in my room chilling... I was I was Snapchatting as a matter of fact. Can y'all hear me? We hear you, my love. Okay, I was Snapchatting as a matter of fact. So I have the recording of you like running up on him and being like, "Who who are you on the phone with, nigga? Why you got secrets? What bitch were you on the phone with?" And like we have to be honest and be like real and say that if there was a physical altercation, the first physical part of the altercation came from you can we like bossiana you were in your room and didn't see anything until i went in there and told you he just punched me or your brother just punched me in the face then i ran up on him and i admitted that already i already said i ran up on him correct but yeah when we had because we had a whole powwow i was sitting on the fireplace he was standing up you was by the bed we had a whole powwow you said that you that when sometimes when you guys get in arguments you have a habit of putting your hands on him first and then y'all start fighting he pushed me. He went, he, look, he was in the bathroom for 45 minutes talking to some girl. I didn't know who he was talking to. I was in the bed and I stayed quiet and I just waited. Then he came out of the bathroom and said, yeah, I'm about to get on her live. I'm going to go live on her page and help her promote her page. Is that cool? And I said, well, I don't even know who you're talking to. So I don't even know how to answer that. And he said, all right, cool. And walked back in the bathroom like I just agreed. And I was like, I, I got up. I went in the bathroom. I said, move out your way. I mouthed, who are you talking to? Because I didn't even want her to hear me asking, so who are you talking to? And he just ignored me. I'm like, so you're just not going to answer me? I snatched, I tried to snatch his phone. I didn't, I didn't get it. And he, that's when he started, oh, hold on, hold on, bitch. Da, 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 da. And then he pushed me to get me out of his way. And that's how it always starts. He pushes me like a grown man push another man. And I slap him on the back. That's where it starts. I'm like, uh-uh, don't put your hands on me. And he punched me in my fucking face. And that's when I ran into your room and told you your brother just punched me in my face. And I came back in there charging. Yes. Mm. I'm going to I'm gonna say what I always say and what I've been saying from the beginning since this first, since this altercation took place. It's like, there's a way when you're having like a conflicting or some type of conversation or some type of argument where the argument's productive. And I feel like sometimes, Yetta, and you did admit to this, and I'm not saying he's innocent because I, I feel like both of you guys have like, it's just toxic. And I tell both of y'all that all the time. But I will say that sometimes it's like, if he doesn't want to talk, like why keep him there to talk? Mm -hmm. I don't understand why he came out of the bathroom to ask me permission if my answer didn't matter. That's where that's where it all went wrong. Cause I didn't say shit the whole forty five minutes. He been sitting there talking, talking, talking. We got a fireplace. It's double double sided. I can hear him on the phone with someone. I just don't know who he's talking to. And I stayed in my in the bed and didn't fucking ask shit. Then he came out there and asked me permission for what? If, if it doesn't matter that my answer doesn't even fucking come through because I don't know what you're talking to. I don't know how to answer that. And as your agent, no, you shouldn't be going live on somebody else's page to get it popping for them. And then next time somebody go to her page and they don't see K9, they're going to bounce anyway. That's stupid as hell. So no, it, it, it doesn't make no sense. And then why don't you just, why don't you just tell me who you're talking to? Mm. That's what makes me mad. Like what, why can't you just tell me who you're talking to? Is it somebody who you shouldn't be talking to? Should, shouldn't I get upset? Wouldn't any bitch get upset? Uh, okay, yes, so let me, they let me would. Yes, yes, they would. But so now at this point, right? So now at this point that you guys have reached a level of toxicity that is kind of like the damage is irreparable, like it can't be repaired. Like um, you did mention previously that if he moved out the house, you would release him. Do you think that releasing him would end the toxicity between y'all? Because now you have no option but to communicate as his agent. He don't need me for shit. He, you think he ever comes to me asking me anything? No. 
He don't sign up for agency PKs. What the fuck? He don't need, uh-uh. And even if he does need to, like I told him this morning, I said, I don't want to release you because I feel like I'm a great agent. And anytime you need me, I'll be here for you. And he agreed. He agreed to that. And I said, and I'll continue to give you gifts because you are my top host. Mm -hmm. He said, I'll give you two, Yetta. He said, and I said, you don't have to do that. But of course, it will be really, it will be, it will be appreciated. Okay, you. queen. The only thing I the motherfucker, hold on, put me on speaker. Can I get on speaker? You're on speaker. You're on speaker. Oh, first of all, yeah, you a whole goddamn lie, bro. I don't know why y'all dumb ass. Some, some people in that business just believe yet to the fullest. Y'all so fucking dumb. Because this shit happened ten times. Every nigga she been with, she act like she never the problem, bro. Y'all just sit here and just play like she never the problem. And she a, what the fuck do she do? Motherfucker say, I'll come in and abuse her every fucking day. Tell me why the fuck you never got a record this and why you never have abuses on your face. Because I don't think like you think. I'm not about to press the board on my phone. When I'm in the middle of a heated argument, I don't think like that. I don't think to set somebody up. Can you mute her? Okay. One at a time. One at a time. Get her. If I hit get her, ain't no one at a time. She been talking the whole time when I'm not on the phone, bro. And when I go live, when I get out of jail, I'm going to go live. I'm going I'm to I'm prove everything. Bro, if I hit get her in her face, she light skinned. Now, Rush, you tell me she light skinned as fuck. She go live every day. Tell me, where do you see a bruise in her face? We, I didn't see a, a, bruise, a, a bruise nowhere personally. Haven't been seeing her, but. I don't know. No, 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 no. If I punch a, a light skinned woman, she would be real I'm perfect. Saying that. It's one hundred. Come on, man. Stop listening to this weird ass woman. A woman that's trying to lock a man up. A woman that say she had one statement, but when I get out of jail, I'm gonna show y'all all ten pages she wrote about me. From selling drugs, from pulling up to a dope thing, you know, that what she said, and her motherfucking shit, all that weird ass shit. She said she wrote one report. Man, that whole report got so much snitching in that bitch. She even got the report when I pull up on somebody talking about he was going to smack Yetta. I got that gun. She said, I pulled up with 10 niggas. I, when I get out of jail, I'm going to show you the report because I got the report on my bed. I can't wait because you're totally exaggerating like you do everything. Can you mute her? Man, bro, I don't know why you even got her talking. I don't even know why they be still on your platform. This is this, this not even about Yetta. I don't even know why they be still on your platform. The bitch only wanted... Like, I'm going to tell you how this bitch... I was in jail. This bitch went on the internet and said, oh, yes, y'all bitches, I got K-9 caught. So what's the point of telling people you got my call? What's the point? You was a clout chasing ass bitch. So they stopped thinking I'm the reason why you in there. I paid your fucking warrants. I'm going to help you get your vehicle so it doesn't get impounded. They're all hating on me. For what? And you like that shit. That's weird. This lady is delusional. The That's weird. Bro. You mute this woman, bro. Mute this woman. What's the point of she's still talking? What's the point of she's still talking? I'm not even on the phone. She's still talking about me. This lady is weird, gang. Like, she did the same thing to Leah. She did the same thing that everybody, she come around, everybody fucking say she weird. This lady is weird. She's controlling. She kind of control me. You know, tell me when to eat. Tell me how to eat. Motherfucker, she talking about she buy this all that. This lady is weird. She is a controlling freak. Like, she trying to control everybody's life but hers. She don't know how to control her damn life. Stop um, you and this lady. Don't let this lady get on your motherfucking platform because this lady love for doing lie, 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 lie. And people mm -hmm. them all the time. We never heard what Yetta do. Can we really get a story of what Yetta do? This Yetta, what the fuck she do? She plays. Okay, K9. You don't even admit what you do. Okay, K9. With y'all sitting here talking. You kind of did like call her to come help you out in the situation. So it's like it's giving like mixed confusion and we not understanding why y'all so at odds when all y'all keep doing is keep finding each other and keep coming back to each other some way, somehow. So it's giving like, are you with her? Are you still going to be dealing with her? Or what is really going on? You're not getting the point. Y'all not getting the point. Y'all saying some crazy shit. Actually, she had a whole agreement, a whole life about me. And so why the fuck she still release me? You talking about you good of an agent. You know, in the new Vigo rules, if you're bullying your, one of your hosts, yeah, 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 that's a new rule. How can you call anything bullying? You're the one who tells people to go report me. You're the one who does that. That's bullying. I don't fucking bully you. That's the comments. Hold up. Y'all mute her real quick. Mute, mute this lady real quick. When do I say go report Yetta when I'm on my live? I don't say report Yetta. I don't you say said it in your Discord. You know. No, you is cap. Yeah, I'm gonna report to Beagle that you bullied that you fucking with me. So 
So so last night you didn't say seventy reports, y'all keep on texting Bigo. No. I say I'm reporting my shit to Bigo because I'm trying to get released from your agency. That's what the fuck I say. I say I don't want to be a leash to you. I don't want to do you say you own You have one minute left. All that crazy shit about me. So why the fuck is I'm still in your agency? Release yeah, me. you just don't want to release until y'all can separate and move the hell on. Why the fuck you ain't release me yet? Yeah, release me. Release me. I please. don't understand why i should miss out on my finances because this man is disrespectful and trying to demand that he gets his way you get you get more you get you catch more flies with honey baby you catch more flies with honey you know the phone's about to hang up sir <laughs> i'm not about to take an l to please him what you heard me bitch you want to suck honey pussy or something what? No. You catch more flies with honey. It's an expression. No, you fletch. You catch more flies with honey than you do vinegar. Meaning, if you're sweet to people versus mean, you get more out of life. That's what she's trying to say. No, <laughs> shut up. That girl sounded so delusional. You're not about to get what you want by calling me all types of bitches and hoes. Okay. Bye. All right. Well, <laughs> until later. Hopefully, he calls you, Royce. Cause goddamn. Girl, these two need to squash this nonsense. Can you drop me? Cause for some reason, every time I press yes, my box, you can't. Love you, boss. Thank you. This too. Y'all gonna have to squash this and end this. I don't know what it'll take. I understand, like, not releasing somebody from the agency, but it's just so bad and it's just so toxic. Like, all this back and forth and, and who did what, who, who abused who. Like, it, it's crazy. Yet, do you really want to continue to experience this? He's my top host. Why should I let him go? He don't need me for nothing agency related, y'all. He just need me to go get his car when he get arrested. He need me to go rescue him from the side of the road when he too drunk to drive. He need me to go pick him up when his fucking Hellcat gets confiscated by the police. That ain't got shit to do with the agency. Nothing. I don't blame you. Agency is their mo agency is the money. It's for the money, yeah. But uh, oh, I'm doing my job as an agent for it's, sure. Because yeah. I, I take care of all of my hoes. Y'all just gonna have another reason to keep bumping into each other and to keep bumping heads. No, I, why? What for? What? If he need a replacement for his agency PK, he don't sign up for PKs. He just makes up a PK and says, "Tomorrow, y'all, I'm gonna PK Mother Candy." And it don't even be official. He don't need me for shit. He don't need his agent. He's going to get his pay in full. I'm going to keep on dropping dragons on him because that's what I do as a good agent, even though it's not required of me. So what the fuck is the problem? That's going to be your... Uh, you do understand. That's going to be y'all main tie unless he going to get another page or make something else. But I'm pretty sure he don't want to start over. Y'all going to keep running into each other. It's going to keep Sounds being... personal. Sounds personal. That's what he used to say to me all the time. I don't want to keep that attachment. I want to keep that money. I don't see why I should give up money because he's disrespectful. Nope. If he want to keep on hosting on Beagle, somebody's going to get paid. Might as well be me. Mm. And I, I, it's like I agree with it, but I don't want him to keep doing this. I agree with that statement, but oh, Jesus is just going to get worse and worse and worse. And he's venting and he's lashing out. He felt as though, cause, so last night he was going on a rant too. And basically he felt like he was like taking up for you. He always had your back. And you know, you just did it so wrong. Da -da 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 -da. Y'all both did it wrong. But it's like now with this police report and whatever you said, got him extra convicted. So he's blowing up even more. Like last night, I thought he blew up. Girl, today is even more crazy. So it's like, do you understand how much money work. I just lost paying off a warrant just for him to get pulled over and arrested anyway? Do you understand? Do you understand? Why would I do that if I just wanted him to get locked up? The whole reason why I paid that shit off was so that he didn't go to jail. Mm. And you st uh, and be honest and be honest. Are you still going to have his back if he call you tomorrow to come pick of him course. up? Of course, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Y'all keep running into this crazy circle. Uh, that's love. I guess she really, really love him. Uh, she really, really love him. I don't want to see him down and out. I don't. There you go. 
Are you going to say something? You asked me to get on here. What you say? Are you going to say something? You're up here now. Oh, yeah. Say, what the hell? What the fuck I was saying? Say, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You remember how you say I couldn't get no place without you, son? You remember you got on your live and say, say oh, on the reason that. I, oh, you put me on a lease is because I ain't had a place to go, and all the time I could get on the lease is because of you, right? I, I put you on that lease so you can get some rent on his yeah, I spent 30 racks on live for your stupid ass to prove a point that I could, get, I could do anything without you. You see that? You saw I how you tried to move me I never said you couldn't. I never said you couldn't. And I bossed up with my own fucking place on your ass. I'm going to tell you how you a jealous, messy ass, no good ass woman. Because you remember that day I lined up with you as Kayla as a joke? It must have been a joke. You start talking about my apartment. Talking about, oh, girl, oh, oh, yeah, that small ass apartment. Oh, that means you is a jealous, miserable ass woman. You know, this apartment that I'm saying is really beautiful. It looks real What good. I said was it's not a condo. You own oh, a condo. You is a miserable a ass woman. Everything you bought on Facebook Market is spirit. All those spirits that you bought from Facebook Market. And y'all call me a witch. Witchy ass house. Y'all call me a witch. That's you hear what he's saying? Problem. My place is possessed yeah, by furniture. Yeah, witchy ass house. And couch. We own furniture. The tables, possessed my house. motherfucking pictures. All them bitches carrying all but spirits, bitch. You got yeah. number spirits carrying around that motherfucking house. You probably have gas right. with the ghost walking around that bitch. Talking about let's build a fucking snowman. Fuck is you talking about, Yenna? Don't sit here and play this fucking game. When you believe in God, you will get your wings and you will fly away. But you don't believe in God. You don't know the definition of believing in God. You don't know the definition of having hope in God and having faith. Because you just the one devil-ass motherfucker. One step away to a motherfucking jumping off the motherfucking bridge. You just, just so fucking miserable. Miserable off the motherfucking all. On one thing of a motherfucking other. You play so black, but you act white as shit. I ain't never seen a black person say she a Karen. When a person call you white... You get offensive, but you act white. You play a black role, but want to be white. I never seen that shit in my life. But you get on the internet and play another role, like you just this boss bitch and have so much mouth. But when somebody want to come beat your ass, it's always, oh yeah, I'm going to call 911. Oh, that bitch can do all of this. How you have so much mouth? How you have so much mouth?